Hello and welcome to another episode of Two Riders. Today we are going to do a tasting and review of a smoked salmon fish product from Finland. This is called Fishcock. No kidding. It's um, smoked salmon cooked between two layers of dark rye bread. Uh, this is something I ordered from Veristerleka in Finland. They're great folks. Um, there will be mentioned again during this video and as you can look at the can it says it contains no cock. Let's get started. This is going to be the tasting of the uh, Varustaleka salmon in a can called Fishcock. This is the second half of my first order. Uh, the first one was terribly damaged and destroyed by customs, uh, repacked by the U.S. Post Office. It took one week to get it from Finland to customs and then 17 days to get it here from the Postal Service. When I contacted the great folks at Varustaleka, um, talked to their customer service, once they got a few items back in stock that I had originally ordered, they sent this via DHL Worldwide Express. They told me last Monday that they were shipping it. Uh, Tuesday I got notice that DHS got it. Today is Saturday. They got here in under six days straight from Finland uh, through customs and everything. This is fantastic. And we're going to go in here and uh, try some of these great items here shortly. And now we're going to give this a try. And... My partner in Two Riders is not a big smoked fish guy, but my wife, my other real partner, is. And uh, so what we have here is the Calicaluco smoked salmon in rye bread. And uh, being called fishcock, which is the Finnish translation in English, makes for all kinds of jokes on their site. What I'm going to do is take the paper out here, and as you can see... If you have Google Translate, you can translate that, but it's all in Finnish, and I don't speak Finnish. One thing I've noticed from some of the uh, videos is that if you pop it open with this uh, don't need a can opener opening, there's a little rim around there, and it's hard to get the product out. So what we're going to do is open it with a can opener, and I'm going to get out a couple of MRE spoons. And we're gonna dig in. So, there's one, there's two. And this is two layers of rye bread with smoked salmon in between. And what we're gonna do is pause this because my can opener is not working, so I'm gonna use a Swiss Army knife, but I'm not gonna make you watch it. So, less than a minute with the Swiss Army knife, and here is the, you can see the rye bread, it's like two big rye crackers. With uh, salmon in between, we'll just loosen it up with the old fixed blade, or folding blade here. We're going to pop it out. Ta-da! Now, the proof of the fish cock is in the eating. I think somebody said that once, so we'll give it a try. That looks good. So, smoked salmon and rye. Nice time of year. It's uh, officially fall. Hmm. My wife is making a face that says, I'm not really a big fan of smoked salmon and rye. Mm -mm. But if I were, this would be tasty. <laughs> this is good. Uh, so on the package, you'll be seeing the package coming up. Uh, you can go to their website. 
They're long-term storage foods. Not MREs and it's not survival food, but the fish products, when you click on them, they can come to the U.S. The ham products, no. The freeze-dried stuff that's similar to Mountain House, I would think, they don't ship it to the U.S. either, which is very odd, but um, they have a great selection of new and surplus products and food products and other interesting things. If you like these other videos, show us that you like it. Click on like. If you want to see more of these, because we're going to have a, a lot more coming up, uh, some of the outdoor stuff now that the weather's cooling, and more reviews of things from Vera Seleka, click on subscribe. You'll be notified. And as always, thanks for looking in.